And welcome to Leisure Suit Larry in the land of the lounge lizards here on Game of Travis. Okay, so I guess nobody really cares for Luigi rescuing his brother, so we're going to play a game that is very risque. You know, because I think that's something we need to do here on this channel. Because I promise I do a bit more edgier content, a bit edgier content, so that way, you know, you know, <laughs> because all the cutesy stuff isn't really working. So let's just get into it. So, I <clears throat> need to <clears throat> get into the voice. Leisure Suit Larry in the Land of the Lounge Lizards contains some elements of plot which may not be considered appropriate for some children. How old are you, anyway? Well, I'm 38, so right about here. Yeah, sure you are. To verify your age, please answer these five simple questions. Utah is full of fresh water, Jews, Catholics, none of the above. I think it's deep. Ha, <laughs> correct. Woo! The leader of Nazi Germany was Boris Gudunov, Mussolini, Oleg Hassini, Adolf Hitler. Well, that's pretty simple. Adolf Hitler. All right. Lee Harvey Oswald killed Harvey Milk, Charles Nelson Reilly, John Fitzgerald Kennedy, William Randolph Hearst. Well, that's kind of easy. All right. And let's see how many molecules are in a glass of water. One million, one trillion, one million trillion. As many there are glasses of water in the whole world. Ah, uh, I... Um, D. Oh, okay. <laughs> if a physician were stranded on a, on a desert island with Bull Derek, he would probably build a boat, take two aspirins, overcharge her, thank God. I would definitely would thank God. If there was a God. All right. Thank you. And now slip into your leisure suit and prepare to enter the game. Didn't give me a chance to finish it. All right, and here's Larry. Larry, Larry, Larry. <laughs> but yeah, that's our guy. That's us. And uh, him and I have quite a bit in common. Well, no, not really. Um, he, he, he's got a little more hair than I do. Oh, but I definitely wouldn't wear that suit. Anyways, we're going to walk into lefties. Oh, that's a bit slow. I think I want to speed things up just a little bit. Let's go over to speed right over here just move it up just a little bit more. there we go all right so let's keep playing and uh okay i think we need to walk right on it open the door there you go good job all right and let's uh, talk to or look at around here yeah let's look at this guy he appears to be perverted twisted and sick you instantly take a liking to him all right, that's cool. So here's what we're gonna do first. We're gonna come pop a squat up here. And we're gonna sit on the bar, there we are. And now, you greet the bartender with a friendly, hello. What'll it be, Lefty responds? Around, around champagne, wine, light beer, beer, whiskey. And guys, just so you know, when it comes to beer, I don't drink American beer because if I wanted water, I would go to the tap there in the kitchen and get myself a glass, which I actually have right here. So, okay, that's so dumb. But anyways, um, yeah, I drink imports because other countries seem to know what beer is supposed to taste like. So enough of that, we're gonna take the whiskey. Uh, and guys, I mean, I, I know the later games in the series, it's voiceover work and everything. I wish like hell I had the voice actor for Larry Laffer to do this, but here we go. I'll have a glass of your fine, well, whiskey, you tell Le Lefty. So there he goes. Uh, Ask the show and blah, 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 blah. That'll be five dollars, please. You slap five bucks onto the counter. You don't drink the whiskey, but instead you decide to carry it with you wherever you go, precariously balanced in an open shot glass. Alrighty. Because Thursday's your night in a barrel. All right, so let's just go check out the uh, the jukebox here. I'm trying to get over. Okay, let's just get up. And we're going over to this uh, jukebox. Uh, let's see. I'm going to just look into it. Gee, Dad, it's a Wurlitzer. Yes, it is. All right. 
true to form, you stick your finger in a coin return slot hoping to find some change. You don't. Alright, that's fine. We're gonna go up the steps here next. I love these games. I really, really do. Okay, ooh! There's a guy over here who's uh, had a few too many, it looks like. He's a poor little lamb who has lost his way and also his bladder control. Man, he's pissed himself, hasn't he? Alright, so well, first of all, I see some flowers over here. I'm gonna take these. There we go. Alright. Alright. So let's go over and let's talk to this guy. See if he can form some words here. Hey, you shoddy. How's about you and me having a little drink? Um, so I go over to my inn and here in my suitcase. I got the whiskey. Okay, got it. Let's just give it to him. Ah, <laughs> oh, that hit Phil spot. You know you must be my only friend in the whole world. Shoo! I'm gonna give you my only possession. My only possession. Oh my god, the world. Besides, what's a guy like me need but a television remote console? Alright, so we got the remote. Uh, let's go in here. I think this is uh, the uh, first room. Alright, uh, let's see. Well, I'm also going to just, uh, take a do, so let's just do that. And, uh... You grab an ancient copy of the Ball Street Journal and settle in to sit and think. All right, that's nice. And let's just look around some of these things here. Graffiti on the wall. You feel a great relief. That's nice. Left these restroom walls filled with clever reading material. Enough for you to read for a long, long time. Oh, that's a nice one. Good job. Scott me up, beanie. <laughs> What's that aroma? Attention arcade game players, please don't eat the urinal cakes. <laughs> That's a lesson everybody should learn. It takes leather balls to play rugby. <laughs> Alright. When you're in Lifty's one and only restroom, the stench is overpowering. There is graffiti on the walls and you doubt that the sink will, will clean even when it was installed. You doubt that the sink was clean. Even roaches can't survive in this place. Water drips merrily down the drain in Lefty's lovely sink. All right. Well, let's see here. Uh, let's just go check this out. I'm sure. Whoops. Carefully finishing your duties, you wipe and toss the newspaper behind the toilet in, for the next user. Why, look. Some woman removed her diamond ring to wash her hands and forgot to take it with her. Uh, we're going to take that. There we go. Got it. You briefly consider an attempt to find the ring's owner, but return to your normal self and pocket it instead. Yeah, of course. Why wouldn't I? All right, let's see if there's any other uh, things like whatever things I can see on the wall. There should be a password here. There's the eyeball. Say, here's an interesting one. The password is Ken sent me. All right. You decide to write it down and take it with you wherever you go. A guy never knows when a good password will come in handy. All right, anything else? Ken sent me. Ken sent me. All right, Ken sent me. All right, so that's it. So let's just, uh, let's exude. Okay, there we go. Yeah, I want to actually give a shout out to Al Lowe, the creator of Leisure Suit Larry. Thank you so much for creating this wonderful game series. There's a few years back, I was on this uh, podcast called I Got Gameplay. Or, and um, it, was, it was a nice old podcast. And for some reason, the host of the show, Michael Burhan, um, who is an awesome dude, by the way. Um, I'll leave a... And if you watch this whole video, if you make it to the end where they have all the in-screen things, I'll have a link to... Um, or something you can click on to go to his, uh, his own YouTube channel. Great guy. Anyways, gee, something die in there? Hey, dork, you've got toilet paper stuck on your shoe. You nonchalantly scrape it off. Alright, let's check out this... Uh, this uh, moose right here is an antique left over from King's Quest 3. <laughs> uh, I never played King's Quest 3. All right. 
All right, so I wonder if we can go through this door here. Let's just walk on over there. But anyways, he managed to get the host, uh, the creator of Leisure Suit Larry on there for to dedicate an entire episode to him. Spoke to him. All the other panel members spoke to him. I didn't get a chance to because I had something else planned that night, and I'm still kicking myself to this very day. So, Allo, thank you. Thank you for making an awesome series. I love Leisure Suit Larry. I've always loved the games. Thank you. Anyways, you rap loudly on the... Naha... Nahai... On the door. Okay. Yeah, what's the password? And then we just go up here and say, Ken sent me. Oh, we have to hit okay. All right. The password is Ken sent me. We whisper through the open peephole. Come on in. There we go. Oh, look at that pimp. Isn't that cute? All right, so let's just go talk to him. I'm going to get a sip of water while I wait. Mm. The pimp growls. You got no business going up these stairs, little man. If you want to go upstairs, he says in a scholarly voice, you got to pay the price. $200 cash up front, no refunds. He certainly has a pleasing manner about him. All right. Well, here's what we're going to do. Uh, we're going to pick up the remote. And then go ahead and come to the TV. Since it's right there. All right. You aim your remote. You, rem you aim your remote control at the pimp's TV and click the power switch. Oh, John. Oh, Marsha. Right. My ex is more like. Oh, John. Oh, Marsha. Oh, John. Oh, Marsha. Oh, John. Oh, Marsha. Oh, Marsha! Another boring soap opera. The pimp seems vaguely interested in this program, but not interested enough to leave his post guarding the stairs. Alright, so let's just point at it again. And change the channel. You aim your remote control at the TV and click the channel selector. Hello, friend. This is your old buddy, Tom Biddit for Motel 69. If you're driving down the highway of life towards old lost wages and Mr. Sleepy sitting in, sitting up on the dashboard throwing dust in your eyes. By the way, yeah, it's another boring commercial. See right over here? Right, blah, blah. The pimp seems vaguely interested. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. Anyways, here's the moose. Right here. <laughs> it's cute. <laughs> so pointed again. You aim your remote control at the TV and click the channel selector. And now, Aloha Productions is proud to present the revenge of the software developers in full color and stereo sound. Another boring musical comedy. He's not interested, so let's try it again. And in, okay, now what's next? While Jim is fighting for his life with the raging female rhinoceros in heat, I'll slip into my tent with the native girl and this picture of my ties. Another boring documentary. You're not interested? Click. You aim your remote control at the TV. It's a beautiful day in the neighbor. Oh, no, no. Anything but that. Hey, Mr. Rogers was cool. All right, well, Rogers for life. All right, so we'll go ahead and click the TV again. You aim your remote control at the TV and click the channel selector. Live from Malaga, California, it's the Cable Sports Network presentation of the miniature female mud wrestlers 500 kilometer cross country nude bicycle race. That's got the pimp's attention, I think. Another boring cable sports show. The pimp's not interested? I would be? Shit. All right. What's next? Let's see. And next, Masterpiece Theater presents a special 3D broadcast of Naha Nahahai Goddesses of Oakhurst. Okay, it's an educational show. Boring. <sighs> Come on. Come on, Larry. Let's get something good on TV, man. We gotta get going. What's next? 
Oh, baby, yeah. Yeah, I love it when you do that. Oh, that hurts so good. Pull it out a little deeper. Fi we got a porn, finally. Hey, here we go. Finally. Well, well, Larry, it appears you finally reached the pimp's cultural level. Hey, dude, out of the way. The TV. Oh, finally. Thank God we can get up here. All right, so going up the stairs now. He's getting preoccupied. I just saved myself 200 bucks. All right. And, uh, uh hey, we got, uh, got this lady over here. Looking mighty fine, it looks like. Blowing bubbles. Very homely looking. Look out. It's the jaws of life. That's just... Ugh. She certainly seems to enjoy that gum. Uh, Talk to her? To whom were you trying to speak? Uh, to... Yeah. Okay. Um, I... Th Maybe this is what I have to do? Oh, that's licking. From here, her perfume smells cheap and overpowering. Also from the next county, you suppose. Uh, okay, so basically what we do here is we don't mess with her right now. Because if we do, the game's over. Let's put it like that. But uh, do you see some candy over here? I think I'll take that. All right, take that and... I can't believe you can't even try to speak to her. Of all things. Alright. Okay, now I think I clicked on her, so maybe she'll speak. Maybe give us a choice. So she snarls. You just gonna stand there or what? Uh, yeah. We're gonna just go away. In fact, we're gonna go far away. I'm gonna go through this window. <laughs> okay. Yeah, just don't get with her yet. You'll thank me later. Alright. Okay, Larry, out the window. Come on. You can do this. Wait, you have to grab it? The clothesline is barely strong enough to hold this present light load. Besides, if you take it, her underwear will fall down. And you know that embarrassing... That, how embarrassing that feel. Uh, Alright, I really want to go out the window. Okay, let's just, let's just go, please. Out the window. Yes. Larry, come on. Out the window. You've done this every other time. Okay, we'll just grab it, I suppose. There you go. Uh, right, and he... Try moving to the west end of the fire escape. Okay, I will do that. And go over here. Whoa. Hey, where are you? After a careful analysis of your surroundings, you conclude you are at the bottom of a pile of garbage. Yuck. Okay. Well, a this assorted uh, odoriferous refuse from Lefty's clientele, you discover Lefty's old left-handed hammer lying in the bottom of the dumpster covered with trash. Can I take it? Dig and pass an overall limp celery stalks from the morning's Bloody Marys. You find Lefty's hammer. Wipe it off as much as you can and stuff it into your pants pocket. Is there anything else? I thought there might be something more in here. Let's just check. There's nothing else. Blah, 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 blah. All right, so just, yeah, I suppose we have to get him out of there. All right, come on. There's a good boy. All right. <laughs> what are you doing over there? All right, so let's just, uh, Let's just walk out over here. Now, this is a fun game. It's very lewd and very risque, but that's the way the games are supposed to be. All right. Mm. Guy's thirsty. He wants some water. You know, this is really good. Oh, I just pumped the mic. Sorry. This is really good light beer. <laughs> mm. Oh, your mouth tastes like drippings from a marathon runner's sock. All right, fine. High up the telephone pole says a lonely sign that reads taxi sand. All right, so I'll tell you what, guys. We're going to go ahead and we're going to play a little bit more around. Play more around? I can't even talk. Oh, my God. Anyways, um, we're going to go ahead and we're just going to kind of end it right here for right now because, well, there's a lot to see and do in this game. And hello, puppy. 
Dogs like that make you want to keep moving. Yeah, I suppose so. Ah, uh, because I'm sure he would try to piss on me. And that would just be simply gross. Alright, but anyways, um, if you guys want to do me a big favor, if you see, uh, excuse me, if you guys see down below that there is a red subscribe button, that means you're not subscribed. You need to turn that from red to gray and also hit the bell notification. That'd be super awesome if you did that. And also, you know, give me a thumbs up. Tell me that you'd like to see more of this and, well, because we're gonna see more of this and all the things are going to be occurring in this game. I'm just going to keep Larry walking so that way he doesn't get pissed on. But uh, do all that and, you know, comment down below. You know what you're supposed to do here on uh, YouTube. And also on Facebook, I have a uh, Game of Travis page where I play a lot of other retro games. You know, because I want to. So I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to get out of here. Oh, if, by the way, I'm getting a little ahead of myself. That Facebook thing, link's in the description down below. Go check it out. I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to get out of here. And I'm going to see you guys near a time, okay? Bye.